Hey, what's going on guys? This is John from Power and Fun. In this video, I'm going to be doing a quick review of a case that I got for Raspberry Pi 4. This is a, an acrylic, a simple open concept case by GeekPi. It's only a two layer case with some hardware mounts. Very, very simple to put together. Very nice case, very cheap, 10 bucks. It's on Amazon. I've got a link in the description below if you're interested. It comes with everything that you need, plus some heat sinks if you didn't already get it with your Raspberry Pi. If you do not have heat sinks on your Raspberry Pi 4, I highly, highly, highly suggest it, as well as a fan to do some active cooling. Um, it's not a beautiful looking case. For what it is, it does a good job. It keeps your Raspberry Pi off the floor, or off the table, and makes it a little more ornate looking. Like I said, the case is fairly easy to put together. You can get it in a clear, or on the website they say the color's brown. It looks more black to me but I'd go by the website and assume it's gonna be brown. I also bought an almost identical case to this one on Amazon for around the same price the iUnicur acrylic case. Like I said it's nearly identical. I had a little trouble getting the coverings off of the acrylic but that's more cosmetic than anything. It might cost you a little extra time but otherwise like I said just cosmetic. One thing I did find interesting with these two cases is that they both came with screwdrivers however the screwdriver that came with the iUnicur case is downright un usable. Overall, both these cases are good buys. Both the fans are the same, the stock Pi fans. I would suggest you get a better fan if you have a Raspberry Pi 4 to create more of an active cooling environment. I've got some other videos I'm going to be posting with these cases and with some fans and temperature testings coming soon. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell for notification for more videos like this. Feel free to leave me any comments or questions below. Until next time, be safe, be kind, take care, and I'll see you in the next video.